What up, Doe Connors? Part two's details are officially here for the thank you celebration, and we are actually getting a summon for part two, but it is going to be a generic summon as some people might have predicted. So here are the part two details. We got the special missions. This is the legendary summon. It is so uninteresting and so generic that it's literally just called legendary summon. There is no reason that you should be summoning for this. Even if you're a new player, even if you like Ultra Instinct Goku, this is the very definition of a trap banner because they are giving this to you just a couple of days before the Dragon Ball Heroes festivities will begin. And then more importantly, other banners like Trunks and Vegeta and other things moving forward are going to be there. You don't want to be spending your stones on this. This banner is simply just here as a filler to make the, the celebration seem a little bit more complete, but it is very much not so. So don't summon for that. We have some mediocre stone sales that are going to be going live later on tonight as well. Uh, for those of you who are low spenders who spend a little bit on the game, you do have a 50% discount on 32 Dragon Stones twice. So those could be some good pickups for you guys. For those of you who are whales, obviously the 91 stone packs, 20% off will be there for you. In addition, you can get five Dragon Stones. Oh, okay. So this is where they're also trying to get your money. From the 23rd of November until the 26th of November, you can buy five Dragon Stones at the price of one Dragon Stone once per day. So again, Dokkan's trying to get your money in whatever way that they can. Unfortunately, this is a this is a good deal. Five stones for the price of one is a good deal. So that will be going on for a few days. I will let you guys know when it happens. So later on tonight, we'll be getting the Mysterious Kai Ritual Summons uh, for that generic banner. The Extreme Super Battle Road, as I previously said, will be dropping at the same time as the World Tournament. World Tournament will be starting later on tonight, which means your boy's got his work cut out for him because I realized earlier today on my Twitch stream that this is starting at the same time as Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. So for those of you who are Pokemon fans out there, you're probably going to be focusing on that. I am torn, but I'm probably going to have to decide on the World Tournament. I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll see. Make sure you guys are subscribed. I might go live on the YouTube side. I might go live on Twitch. I might do both. One on one stream, one on the other. Just stay tuned. This weekend's going to be very jam-packed for me, so you guys will have plenty of streams to watch. So that's going to be starting tonight. This is the guaranteed SSR summon banner. We got Goku and Vegeta Blue. This is actually pretty good. These units are both decent uh, units, and eventually they will get EZA, so they'll also be really, really good. Uh, we've got the World Tournament Support Pack. We've got a bunch of Dokkan events that are going to be available. Starting from now until the 1st of December, we've got the Raditz story event coming back and the Gohan Videl. This is basically like the Harbingers of Death. When you see them, the World Tournament is around. We've also got the usual stuff that follow which are the Adventure of a Gratitude and Bizarre Rabbit Mob. These story events are all here as well. So free to play players, if you haven't worked on these events, you got some more units to farm out. Other than that, this is going to be a very, very minuscule celebration. This is going to be done in conjunction with Dragon Ball Heroes, which is why there's not as much being offered here. But once again, folks, please do not summon on this legendary summon. It is completely, completely useless. Um, it is just there as a placeholder just to give the illusion of a complete celebration but it is not something that you should be summoning on i would rather you guys summon on a carnival banner than this seriously just don't do it but that's my opinion of course if you want to go ahead but you've heard it from me first don't do it don't do it it's a trap uh special summon or special missions what do we got here we have some elder kai some sleeping kais you got some elder kais there's a dokkan festival ticket that you can get from part one. Oh yeah the uh the part two set of dragon balls are now complete so you can actually pick up more of those tickets you know what actually let me do that on stream or uh, on video right now let me let me go ahead and just summon shenron and let me do this this is the set to dragon ball uh summon animation you can't even hear him I will grant any three. Okay, so I want uh, the Dokkan Festival tickets. Definitely want those. So Dokkan Festival. Get Dokkan Festival tickets. Uh, I want the incredible or the hidden potential orbs. And after that, what do I want? I think I'm just going to go for meat. So I'm going to go for meat, hidden potential orbs, and the Dokkan Festival tickets. There you go. You will be getting three Dokkan Festival tickets. If you think you could save this wish for the next set of Dragon Balls, that is wrong. You can only get those Dokkan Festival tickets on the second set of Dragon Balls. So I hope you guys remember that and wish for it. And now we can actually go do a summon. So let me go do a summon real quick with those tickets. With those tickets that I have now just earned. 
pick all that up here. Um, I can now do a summon. Actually, wait, you know what? I have to get my login first. I can't. Okay, I can't do my summon. The final ticket will be given when I log in for the 15th day during this celebration, which will give me this ticket right here. So that completes the set and that gives you that five summon multi. Anyway, there you have it, folks. That is a look at part two. Don't summon for anything except for that free ticket summon if you get it. Just wait for Dragon Ball Heroes. We should be getting some news in the next few days, maybe even tonight. We'll find out. And as soon as we do, I will let you guys know on this channel. Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like down below and let me know in the comments, are you looking forward to Dragon Ball Heroes or are you just going to be saving up for the next celebration? Let me know in the comments down below and be honest, are you actually going to summon for that legendary summon that you saw in the part two details? Let me know in the comments down below. Also, be sure to subscribe for more dope content in the future and click the notification bell so that you let YouTube know you want to see more of my stuff. Do it! Thanks again. Stay tuned and our to Dokkan responsibly.